Go, go, go. No. No, I believe you mean go. Ordination <laughs> <laughs> will ensue. I was probably not going to have an opportunity to name edge for a while unless I'm forgetting something. Um, that is correct. Because you do go through that whole tower. Yeah, I have to go through the time. tower and then... It be the dwarf castle that would be the next one. I'd prefer just to name Edge and Fosui at the same time. Okay. It makes it uh, easier. So there's definitely a running race between <laughs> for Edge right now. Yes, I guess yeah, we have some time. Well, ah, could, crap. What could you do, do it? it? Could you do it at Mysidia when you pick up the big whale? Or? Well, you enter Mysidia and they immediately kick uh, you yeah, out Yeah, they immediately the kick you into a giant, so no. I mean, I... Yeah. Oh, oh, no, you go back to Earth, and I don't even think you can get to my city. I think as soon as you land back on Earth. Oh, yeah. Well, so no, I mean, wait. What's really funny is that this uh, game's plot gets crazy. So you the city and then they send you out on the whale? Yeah, they yeah, literally kick you out yeah, to the whale. That's what they do. Because he yeah. comes up, he goes, oh, ha, how are you doing? And you're like, oh. Legend! <laughs> and then you have to come back with the site. Yeah, this game's plot gets crazy fast, like, in the second half, it's like... Yeah. And that would be the, uh, you know, one-fourth, you know, one-fourth of the actual script coming into play there. Yeah, mm. definitely. I could definitely see that. Yeah, you're supposed they? to do a lot of like side quests yeah, to build just out, but of side quests uh, actually in the game still, at least relative really to its size. Yeah, it's been a while. Day. Are you willing to take on any uh, like people well, donate well, or something like that? Or? I can make a second save soon and so do that uh, after I get edge or something. But I, I was just wondering. I, I'd be willing to, to take on extra bosses, but I'd rather finish the run first and I can go back and try some, but... Okay. okay. I'm sorry, what extra bosses? Just go, I think you Odin and, like, Leviathan. Uh, Odin, Bahamut. Leviathan, uh, Bahamut, Ashura... You can, um, I can always do the, do the de Demon's Wall. <laughs> yeah, I could Demon actually wall. activate Demon Wall. Yeah. You can't activate Demon Wall. Should we set some donation goals to see uh, Ray and Trump tackle the Demon's Wall and some of the other... Uh, <laughs> We're not having good attack from behind block here, are you? Yeah. This is how an ender... Like, people are joking about rain luck, saying, oh, it's good luck. You guys don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> it's, very, it's a very pa it's a very passive thing. And they, and they just ate video. You know, I was surprised they weren't just like, you lose 100,000 gold pieces right there. <laughs> Which is still only like 1% of what you have. <laughs> That's way less than 100,000. <laughs> Uh, it's like, yeah. Edge uh, rocking the glue wheel here. Edge, I believe, also has a cape, if I'm looking at that sprite correctly. Uh, I think he's he supposed does. to. Really he's catfish. clearly not the sharpest knife in the drawer as he's showing with that kind of plain yeah. magic there. And then Rubicante is showing him uh, how a real man uses fire. Yes. By... I'm, I'm going to assume that's a fire, fire tornado, <laughs> just to give him the benefit of the doubt. Leg. Yeah. Show a leg. Yeah. Could, could use a bit of a tan. <laughs> if you guys uh, haven't seen that Hyatt in uh, Four Fiends video, I suggest while I'm walking to uh, Rubicante, you go ahead and just watch that. That's what it's called, Hyatt in, um, yeah. That's a good video. Did you pee? Could you check your PMs? No, no PMs. Uh, nothing from Alec will What's that? Nothing new from Alec will do. I already talked to him. He said there was another one, but... Can I sit here? <laughs> No, I already responded to this. <laughs> okay, maybe this is just all sorry, man. I don't have time stamps. Uh, yeah, it was about two years between FF7 and FF8, at so least in the like U.S. Stamps. Okay, there we go. Naval time stamps. Uh, both were around, uh... Yeah. Yeah, two years. I remember, I remember, like, I seem to remember that Ninja Fate okay, yeah, like, in the Dreamcast. Yeah, I was like 10 years ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You mean Ninja Trogdor. 9999. So I need to pay better attention, apparently. Yep. And, uh, I know Final Fantasy VII here in the States was around September of 97. Now you mentioned a script limitation, card size limitations for four. Did they run into the same problems with five and six, or? I don't know. I just well, looked up information for this game, so I thought I'd be a nice little information person. Okay. Oh, hey. Good job. Uh, yeah, good job. You did a better job than everyone else. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! You cheated. <laughs> Axe. What's what's the timer? Edge at? has wall zips. Timer is at two forty nine forty. Okay. At about this time, I believe Dane's run would be approaching Zeromus. That's five, $5. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Dane does have a very good run, but it's also very segmented, so he gets <laughs> very, much, very segmented. He, yeah, so he gets so he to print all of the rain luck that could happen in his run. Uh, he does not want to deal with rain luck. Rain luck. 
talk. Brain lock. I, I can talk. Okay, and we do have a bunch of new donations coming in here. We got uh, Jimmy O'Lynn in for five dollars, Zachary Kimlin in for fifteen, uh, Neil Singh in for fifty dollars, and Edwin Chung in for five dollars. Uh, thank you so much, everybody. You are the man. Thank you all. Funniest thing: the last time I streamed this was the one practice where I accidentally went down there because I was so tired. I fought the chest with four mad ogres and won with like a half dead party. I remember that. <laughs> I was like, I don't want to reset. I haven't been saving. I haven't been abiding by the Oyama rule. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this is my own little practice attempt. <laughs> Alright, and we do have some comments with those uh, from Jimmy Lin. You guys are too awesome. How could I not donate in these final hours? Shout out to everyone for their excellent performances. Shout out to Melty Blood as well. Okay. <laughs> uh, Melty Blood is actually a fighting game. It is, it is. Yes. It's an anime fighting game. Yes. And uh, from Neil Singh, uh, let's see, uh, making sure Edge stays Trogdor, right? 50 towards him or whoever, tro whoever is Trogdor. So uh, widening the gap. Yeah, you can move it or whatever. Oh, so, uh, wow. Thank you very much. Uh, I appreciate it. My mom appreciates it. Maybe something good in that. Yeah, okay, PJ. You never know. You never know. You will never know. Yep. I was just staring what if at that you. was Excalibur? What if they moved it since the last time you played? <laughs> since the last time you played. Well, my strat well, since Cecil's actually kind of worthless for the last fight, Excalibur does me nothing. I mean, last fight. This is the last fight. Like, it might be time well, to start calling dead. some friends, because Zed, Neil Singh, just dropped $50. $50, I know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we also got $5 from Daniel Owens, too, so thanks so much, sir. You are the man. Snuck in there. I still got five so as I'm paying more attention here, I'm noting that a whole lot of people, both hero yeah, and villain, have capes in this game. Uh, Which means that this is just a great game. Yes. Yeah. I, I really liked the game even before I noticed that, but that just increases my love for it. Capes are key. Yes. Uh, Rydia doesn't have a cape, but she has a cow. Hey, Blade Mans have capes too. Yeah, awesome. that's what I was just <laughs> noticing. Yeah, Alright guys, I'm gonna handle this fight. Handless and blindfolded. Yes. Handless. <laughs> <laughs> Brain playing peek of it. Elmo folding. Yes, well, I believe Kane is the only capeless wonder in the uh, final party. Actually, if you look at his battle sprite, he has something of a cape. Uh, cape. Oh, yeah. Even though he's, even though he's a whole world sprite, yeah. doesn't. Down to the Hades. <laughs> to oh, no! Fire 2 for 64 damage. I'm think, screwed. I don't to think to I where the just... Satan is. Yeah, the Satan. I never knew that you could just sit here and not fight these guys. And let's do a total check here. We got uh, fifty thousand seven hundred twenty-two dollars and ninety-one cents in the chip-in currently. Wow. Pretty fantastic. Crazy. Wow. So many of the mans and the wool mans and the assorted other things. That is, that, that, that's uh, three thousand one hundred thirty-four individual donations that makes the, making this happen. Indeed. Wow. Pretty crazy. Is, uh, yeah. Is, uh, uh, are you uh, are you done with shouting out donations and uh, for the time being? Yes. Okay. Have we uh, is the Metroid plushie visible on the? Uh, <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> there we go. Uh, Yay! Uh, if awesome. you like that cute Metroid plushie, those uh, you can commission those from our very own Mercury Zelda. Send an email to Emily Lizzie at Yahoo .com. Um, That's Emily E M I L Y, and Lizzie is spelled L I Z Z I. And um, she also does various other video game plushies and video game themed hats, like the, uh, you've been watching the entire marathon, you may have seen the Mega Man hat. And or, she'll, um, she even does gloves, right? And yes. scarves. Yes, she'll do uh, non-video game related things, some gloves, some scarves, and I guess non-video game related hats. Uh, sweaters, not so much. Uh, nothing that really has to be custom fitted, I guess you could say. But uh, gloves, scarves. Uh, and someone asked if she would do if she would knit capes, but as someone else noted, that would just be a blanket. Which uh, I suppose <laughs> she would. I suppose she would knit those. I don't know. And yes, we should be plugging item in as well. Indeed, we Indeed. should. Uh, that Metroid is currently sucking the life out of a uh, uh, pretty awesome perler. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. That is uh, Sophia the Third from Blaster Master. Uh, Dustin Hammondtree at gmail dot com. Hopefully, uh, someone can yeah, post someone it. Can get the exact spot I, item is in the chat, so reason okay. wise. <laughs> And uh, he'll do just about anything uh, that can be put into sprite form, really. Well, okay, he's not anymore, but he was. Er, yeah, okay. Okay. Now, is a gentleman. He is. Of he is honor. Okay, I'll go there. Take care of it. But is he still a jerk? 
<laughs> right, gonna make sure I do that. Permission to sing, sir? Denied. Oh. I keep forgetting Kane always uses the opposite hand. Mm -hmm. 1900, that was a good hit. <laughs> that was a good hit. Someone in chat too is asking if she'd ship to Europe. Um, she's not here to answer that question. I um, think she uh, said she, she would said she ship internationally. Okay, sure. there you have it. <laughs> she would or she wouldn't? She, she would. Okay. Yeah. Um, I, mean, I mean, I imagine the person ordering the item is paying for hey, the ship. Yeah, so exactly. It shouldn't really matter to her where it's going to. Uh, just as a note, uh, when you send her an email, please be patient, because I'm sure her... Uh, a bit of a getting, flood. <laughs> yeah, she's getting more email, I think, than she yeah. ever expected. Yeah, speaking of Mercury Zelda, um, she is actually the... the uh, the one uh, taking care of the Twitter prize. Uh, exactly. Oh, and, the, and the Twitter prize is a Wii. Yep. A brand yes. new Wii with Wii Sports with Wii Resort. Sports Resort. Not and bad for a copy paste. Exactly. Uh, all you have to do is follow S our Twitter, SDA Speedruns, and you just copy paste on what's below the chat uh, mentioning the Twitter contest, and be sure to only post it once. If you post it more than once, you will be disqualified. Indeed. Will for disqualify every additional you time. For each additional time, we will. Uh, if you don't see that, if all you see are a bunch of people uh, on a couch with one of them holding a Super Nintendo, we're not in the right place. Yes. Or Elmo, or they're holding Elmo. Elmo. Yes, you want to go to speeddemosarchive.com where you will see both the game and the commentary streams. Yes, as well wow. as the little blurb for you. Yes, and you were watching the uh, the action-packed grand finale of the uh, awesome games done quick SDA yeah. charity marathon. We've been at it for days. Yes. Yeah. We don't know how many anymore. <laughs> Most of us are ready to just are, collapse in a bed. We are all in a world where time has yeah. no meaning, but uh, all that really matters at this point is that uh, we raised over fifty thousand dollars for the Prevent Cancer Foundation. Indeed. Which, uh, Funny little off fact: if you play hard type, if you catch Shiva in this fight, I don't know if it's always true, but uh, uh, Rubicante gets hit by a subsequent <laughs> ice too as well. Nice. So it either double wow. heals or double damages. So we've probably got somewhere between one and two hours to go in this game, and then uh, that's the end for our uh, scheduled yeah. game, so... Yes. Uh, there will, at some point, after what will no doubt be massively overrunning the credits of this game, uh, there will be a bonus stream at some point, correct, Mike? Indeed. Are we still doing that? We'll definitely be doing that. I don't think it will be tonight, though, <laughs> because okay. we'll I'm just we'll dive right in or not. But do we have, like, yeah. keys to this room that we can lock it or something? So is that going to be in your house, Mike? I'd have to ask the front desk about that. Yeah, I'd have to be at the house or something like that. Mike's about gaming festival strikes again. Part two, the revenge. <laughs> yeah. 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 Poverty edition. Poverty <laughs> edition. Fominos. All the good edition. No. PJ edition. PJ edition. Scary. Poverty James edition. That's funny, right? Sorry, I didn't sing during that battle. They are victorious. <laughs> they had to get. They actually had to no dig through the wall. They didn't wall clip. Yeah. Yeah. They, they don't have punch the wall. Down. They don't have to lead hacks. Yes. And now they have to go back to repair the wall. <laughs> I can't speak for everyone. I got a fair amount. Actually. I don't remember that many games. What's it? Wait, oh no! No. We're talking about our life. Pitfall? Pitfall. What's in that chest? Huh. I don't know, what's this way? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> counter. <laughs> Maybe there's a chest down there. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let's see. I hope you accidentally choose a monster in a box later. <laughs> Uh, so we got a couple new donations. Uh, Timo Bauer in for seven dollars and nine cents, and Glenn Morton what? in for five dollars. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> you really appreciate it. You were both there are poison man. claws hanging on the door. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. That's right. There actually are some invisible treasures in this game. Let's see. Why'd okay. you just leave Edge there? We did have a comment from Edwin Chung. He says, "Keep up the epic work." And uh, Timo Bauer says, "Greetings from Germany. I hope you have fun preventing me from sleep." Because I want to see the ending of FF4. <laughs> oh, well, we're preventing cancer. Sleep's kind of a side effect of that. Yeah. So, <laughs> but thank you very much to both of you. Pretty awesome. Surprise, chat didn't go weird over. Hey, wh where do you get those claws? Uh, well, so Daniel Owens comment did not get read. No. I, I, I kind of, I kind of think most people just didn't even notice. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. All right. We also have another comment that snuck in from Daniel Owens, who donated me. previously. Uh, amazing huh? fundraiser. The simplicity and effectiveness is <laughs> incredible. <laughs> Could you tell me a little uh, about what it took to organize this event? 